And we want to take video to the, really, the next step. Uh, walk, uh, we want you to be able to walk around while the video is actually playing. To have that experience like you're really there, right? The video if you're, that you produce in your eyes moves with you, allows you to travel through the space. That's what would be cool with video. Well, Intel took the first step towards this type of what we call volumetric video technology with our acquisition of replay, replay technologies, which you saw in the soccer clip earlier, which really allows you to move within the space, within a singular video concept. So as you put your headsets on, you've all seen traditional 360 video in VR where you can look around, and that's interesting, and that's sort of a first step. But now we're actually going to take you literally on a journey to Vietnam. So what I'm going to ask you to do first is look at the video around you, just like you would look at a normal 360 video, but now sort of tilt your head from side to side around that barrel there. This is in this amazing waterfall in this very remote area in, in Vietnam. <laughs> and you can see that the water behind that barrel is like you would see in real life, like it's actually happening. Now, if you feel comfortable, sort of lean your head in and over that barrel a little bit, like that, yeah? Just be careful of the wires, but you've got it. Some of you are really going for it, which is great. And you see how everything is changing just like it would in the actual real world? That's what's so, it's pretty amazing to watch you guys do this. Now go ahead and look everybody to the right. And you see that water buffalo there? That was literally captured live volumetric, volumetrically in Vietnam. And as you move a little bit from side to side, feel free to stand up if you're comfortable, but be careful because you're tethered. And you can see the water buffalo um, wrangler there behind. And if you move a little bit from side to side, you see how everything changes in the world. That's because every single pixel in this scene is literally mapped in space, which, of course, is this massive computer, computing undertaking to actually pull this off, what you're seeing. This is something that's never been seen, certainly at this scale, with this many people. We've only seen it in our engineering labs with our engineers working on this. And it's fantastic to see you all literally doing this and taking video to the next level. That's really what's happening here. So, so this is truly amazing. It's fun to watch the crowd. Uh, if, if we just had a way to spray water in their face, <laughs> exactly. I think they think they're Get truly the thing. at the, the waterfall. Um, you know, I, I got to imagine, as you kind of mentioned, there's an incredible amount of data involved in this experience. Yeah, the, the thing as you start to look at this and notice what's going on, this is high fidelity video capture. This isn't CGI. This is not a simulation. This is really actually captured material at a very high frame rate with very high fidelity, which requires massive amounts of computing, which is why partnering with Intel is such a smart idea for on both sides of this equation, because every single frame of this video is three gigabytes per frame as you look around it. So you can imagine the computing power that's needed, and really Intel's the only one that can help us pull this off. So 